Howdy. Thank, thank you, Lise. If you were here, if you were here for the workshop, you get that joke or visual gag. Um, two poems. Um, one I'm going to try to recite. Uh, this is called uh, Nuts and Bolts. Give me a second. Everything is wearing out except what hasn't been born. Here go my politics when you decide if you will listen or take notes. I am addicted to starts. My saved litter the ether. My receipts mark the rising action of many novels. That is to say, I am ever realizing the truth is not here to save me. The left wing and the right wing come together to make a sound as a cellist. There's a lot of blue sky up there no one is going to get his or her hands on tonight. The free, probably as terrible at fighting tyranny as the one dollar candy tastes like a dollar. Sometimes word edits poetry well. Somewhere promise makes practice. Some when grace slunk in the shade during our long day of doling out blame. Some what form comforts, but we have only this limitless supply of names. Some which must exist for this some which must exist to end this spell of just getting by. And this second poem this is called a uh, poem for C. D. Howe. My, re my recent hang-up on utility has supplanted any interest I've ever had in the good. It's been so long, Clarence, what's a million how? The amateur partisans with their artisanal pragmatism believe your big picture cost-benefits analysis karma. What are these poems only I read and reread but war whales? I've wanted to give you a poem, but I always got lost looking at everything. I fear it's too late, Clarence. Anyone I've met has had to explain myself to him or herself. I know my dreams are filled with familiars, but Clarence, former minister of everything, tell me from your cosmic station, how have I fared in my former lover's dreams? In Annabelle's, do I dig her for answers? In Tamara's, do I stand astride the exit? In Mary Ulrich's, am I man or still thirteen? In Amanda Wise's, did we kiss? Ah, how I impress myself, my fantasy is imperial. But Clarence, it's getting better. Since I brought it up, my wife's told me twice about her dreams about me. In the second, some former roommate harangued her, you're not good enough for him, he deserves better. But Clarence, between the audience and us, a dreamt word is as worthless as a dreamt dollar. Thank you.